4K 60 frames per second, front facing camera, Xiaomi 14 Ultra using the Intel One mics, yes, 4K, finally, and even 60 frames per second here on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra's front facing camera. What do you think about this one here? I think I'll see a little bit overblown highlights there in the background. This is the latest update that I have here on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, same as on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra here, and uh, I think this is running pretty smoothly. What do you think about this one? 4K 60 frames per second, uh, front facing camera on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra. Just like on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, I'm using the internal mics. You can record 4K 60 frames per second, which is quite nice. And we have stabilization, which is also very nice. So what do you think about uh, this uh, one here? I think it is quite good, even though we have a little bit of issues with HDR. And now the main camera of the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, still the internal mics. The aperture is set to probably f2, what I can see here with my eyes, so it's not fully open. It's a little bit closed, so I think it's f2 that it uh, decides to do here. And yeah, what do you think about this here? 4K 60 frames per second, I have the possibility to switch between all lenses. So let's go to the ultra wide angle here. We have the ultra wide angle, nice uh, zoom out option there. And if I want to, I can also zoom in on stuff. So let's try to zoom in on the playground sign there in the background. So let's go to 3.2 times directly and then 5 times zoom and it switch lenses and I can go up to 10 times. If I want to even more, 15 times zoom are possible and it, I think it's jumping out of focus a little bit there. What do you think about this one here? Let's go back to one time. Uh, just like the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, now the Oppo Find X7 Ultra has the same sensor, one inch type sensor, but no variable aperture. So we have a wide open aperture here on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra. So what do you think about this one here? Uh, 4K 60 frames per second, of course I have the possibility to switch between all lenses. So let's go to the ultra wide angle just by pressing a button. And there we are at the ultra wide angle. So this is also pretty nice, even in this like sunny kind of situations. How does it handle my face color and stabilization? And of course, if you want to zoom in, we can switch between two periscope uh, zoom lenses there as well. So let's go directly to three times. This is the three time lens. And let's go to six times. This is six times. And I can go to ten times. And if I want to zoom in even further, I can zoom in up to 18 times. So even a bit further than the Xiaomi 14 Ultra. And let me focus on this one here, tap to focus. I think it is working fine as well. Let's go back to the one time zoom. Let's check out the front facing cameras. You can see it's a bit more wobbly on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra. We have a bit of more HDR on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra, a bit more contrasty look on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra. And in general, both are doing a very fine job in 4K 60 frames per second. What do you think about them both here? When it comes to the main camera sensor, we can see the same contrasty look on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, a bit more reddish kind of face, a bit more natural kind of colors on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra. We have a bit of uh, more busy bokeh on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra because it's using F2, where the Oppo Find X7 Ultra is using a larger opening there. When we go to the ultra wide angle, we get basically the same, more contrasty, more punchy colors on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, more reddish kind of face, more natural colors on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra. And when we take a look at the zoom capabilities on both, we can see that the Oppo Find X7 Ultra has a bit of a stutter switching the camera to a 3x zoom there. But afterwards, it's very, very smooth and a bit more contrasty in this uh, scenario. A bit more wobbly on the Xiaomi 14 Ultra, where the Oppo Find X7 Ultra is struggling just a little bit with the field of view, because what I saw on the viewfinder is a bit different to what I was capturing here. But I think overall, the Oppo Find X7 Ultra wins.